Okay, now that we've talked about the common sense aspect of the restaurant industry, I'd like to address a few other points that you might not yet have thought of if you're new to our industry or you're very aware of because you've been working in our industry a while and you're just shifting to a different place to work. But what I would like to talk about with you commonly is that we have this proclivity to get tired on our job. So what's really important to me as a company is that you be very clear with your manager on the shift you're on of what you can and can't handle when you get overwhelmed. At the same time, I really want you to understand that we want you to be working in the most prime time of your energy levels. <clears throat> so if you're a morning gal, we want to know you'd prefer to work in the morning. If you're more of a I sleep late kind of person, we want you to be on the midday shift, helping us prepare lunch and whatnot, or dinner basically shift. But if you're kind of a more of a late night person, we'd like to know that because we might have you just come in for a few hours every night so that you've got other parts of the day to do your thing. But something that's sort of important to us is that you start to understand one most humble and common business principle that has nothing to do and everything to do with what you're doing right now in coming into this job. That the number one rule of every single business in the world according to the late and great Peter Drucker, which you can look up on your own online sometime, and we'll put a little page in front of you about that so you get that, is to make and earn customers. To make and earn customers means that that person might shop with you every single day, and that person might shop with you once a week. And you might notice kind of a consistency of faces coming to our counters or through our drive throughs or in for takeout delivery. But what I want you to remember is that every time is when we make and earn customers. We cannot take advantage and we cannot take for granted our consumers because it's our consumers' hard-earned dollars, it's their discretionary income, meaning the extra money they have for their life, instead of going to a grocery store to go home and make the food, that brings them into our shop and our store and our location. So your primary job in every instance of working with your fellow team members to deliver food hot, correct, and on time is to make and earn that customer so that they come back to us, if we can, daily, but if not that, time after time. 